since the days of Jesus and the apostles, it has been declared that we are living in the last days. How can this be if the earth is only 8,000 years old as some people interpret it to be through scripture? Remember that Jesus ascended over 2,000 years ago. That sounds inconsistent to me. How can a young model of earth be consistent with us being in the quote unquote last days for well over 2,000 years when everything has only been in existence for such a short time? Here is another perspective that makes more sense to me and many others. The ancient Hebrew word for day was yom. The word yom could also mean an age or a long period of time. So what if the days of the Bible don't represent 24 hour periods of time, but seven long periods or errors of time? Many Christians who are also scientists believe that the six days of creation stretch over 14.7 billion years. So let's take a look at this King James Version keyword study Bible. Let's use this leather binded study Bible a little differently today. Let's use it as a demonstration tool. What if every numbered page in this Bible represented time from creation until now? Under the old earth model, our planet would not even appear until the book of Hebrews. Plant life would not appear until the glossary at the end of this study Bible. Humans would not appear until the last paragraph of the last page. Moses and Jesus would not show up until the second to last sentence. So if you believe in an old earth paradigm, the concept of the last days actually fits. In fact, we ain't even in the last days. We are in the closing credits and this is all about to wrap up. Understanding the grandness of time and creation though, we could be in the last days for a thousand more years and the scriptures would still be consistent. As you meditate over what you believe, be sure not to drag God down to your concepts of time and space. Remember, He is infinite. Learning to worship Him in spirit and in truth entails learning how to put on the mind of Christ not making God fit within our boxes.